Okay, go. All right, so Charlie Brown is here. We do his teeth, and he, right here in the middle, and you can kind of so softly touch the zoom. Right there in the middle, I had already, right? I had already taken some hair out of the, in between these two teeth right here. Come here, baby. Come here. Let me just see. Can I just see a second? Do you see inside that two, the two teeth right there? Yeah, you can. Okay, so now I had already taken out a big chunk of something, something in there. Now, I'm not here to do a dental or nothing like that, but I do see that that's just debris in his mouth. And what I want to do is kind of, let me see here. Let me see. <laughs> you got such an overbite here, I can't even see. Oh my goodness, it's huge. Uh, whatever he just probably swallowed. Let me see. So now there's a hole there. Yeah, you can see. And you can difference. see what that hair in there has been just rotting out those two teeth. So I will let mom know she had some hair in there causing some problems. Now what's important is that you, so we did Pets Life Gel on his teeth already, but if I saw something like that, then, then that's where you wish you had a toothbrush, okay? So get yourself a doggy toothbrush, have it around. You may not always uh, chisel the toothbrush and do all that until it's bloody or anything like that. But you need, if you see hair right there, get that out of there. Okay, so Charlie's one of my favorite boxers when he comes in. He is just an absolute sunshine and he is so sweet and kind and he wouldn't bite anybody. He is just an, a magical animal. So this last groom that we did, you could see what we saw and found in his teeth. And we actually do uh, the Pets Life Gel on his teeth because he's a little bit older and it helps to rub itself on that plaque buildup and it's it's shown here and said proven to break down that plaque buildup if used over time and I believe that comes with the fact that this product the Pets Life Gel has essential oils in it like peppermint I think that that helps break it down um, the difference between this product and another one we carry Esprit Oral Care Gel is the fact that this has distilled water and this one doesn't so if you know anything about distilled water, that may be the influence of you picking between Pets Life Gel and the Esprit. Now, mind you, this company, Pets Life Gel, has been bought out by Esprit. So Esprit owns this, this company right now, okay? So that way you know you're getting a kind of the same product, except for the ingredients are a little bit different. And you can see it and reflect it in the price. So this one starts at $8.99 and this one is $16, okay? So you have some options. I would use either or. Right now we are using the Esprit for our pets at home. We've used this uh, Pets Life Gel since it, it came out for a few year, more than a few years now. I love this stuff. On the pump, you want to be careful. You twist it to pump it. I pump it on my finger, apply it to the teeth. The pump is pretty strong. So you could do one pump and probably have enough for the full mouth if you know how to do it right. We used to brush pets teeth regularly with toothpaste, right? Pet toothpaste. And, uh, they have malt flavored pet toothpaste. It smells like dog food. I don't. I used it a few times when in the beginning of my career, and I was like, "Why are we using this?" When I want my dog's breath to smell not like food, so I stopped carrying the malt flavored toothpaste. They, I think they came up with that so the pets enjoy eating it, basically, because it's not like something that you rinse out of their mouth. Okay, their dentals and their teeth brushing that what we do is not like the way we do it. We don't spit it. We spit ours out. They don't spit theirs out. Okay, so I don't. We went away from that and the reason why I went away from doing the teeth brushing is that I would do so many teeth brushings for five bucks. It was just five bucks for me to put, put toothpaste on here, brush the dog's teeth. And what I found was there were so many teeth that are not regularly brushed and they would be so affected by the toothbrush bristles, like the gum line. And I would be like, no, we, you can't brush every dog's teeth with this. If you don't brush them daily or every other day or weekly, you will start to see that you're just ruining the gum lining, exposing a bloody tissue. It's just not right. You just don't want to do that. So you need to, if you're going to use a toothbrush, so Pets Life Gel, the way I use it at home with our pets is we apply it on our fingertips, rub it on their gum line, okay? If you're going to use a toothbrush, you want to get it, get it wet first so the bristles are a little softer, not just dried and crusted. And you can, you can either use it with the Pets Life Gel or just use it with water and move that around. And there will sometimes be chunks of food or debris stuck in the teeth, which there was with Charlie. I mean, a huge one where I was sitting there and I was like, I have to get this out. I could see it in between the crack of his two teeth in front. And it just sat there and caused it all to be black inside there. That food just sat there food and it'll probably like hair debris so if there's black in there what is that that's some type of like corrosion would you say right or rotting 
and it's just eating into the teeth. So eventually those teeth need to be cleaned by a professional veterinarian. A professional dental cleaning is not just brushing the teeth. It's actually like chiseling all that off the teeth, okay? And in some cases it will be so bad that the teeth actually have to be pulled out. So me catching that and showing the mom, hey, here's a toothbrush, work that, make sure food doesn't get stuck in there and sit there for days on end, months. All right, so we were able to use a toothbrush. So we sell these at 99 cents. I mean, they're very affordable. Um, or if you have one already, be using it. But you have to get in the habit of using it regularly or the teeth are gonna just be really raw and the gum line's gonna be really raw and you don't want that. That opens up that bloodstream to all kinds of bacteria in the mouth. So pick one and go with it. If you try one or the other, you'll st if you try one and you don't try the other, you won't know the difference. So you could always try one or try the other and then try the opposite the next run. A Pets Life gel for all three of our dogs, we'll probably use that whole, and it's very little. I mean, it's not, it's not like a huge bottle. This one, we probably, four ounces will probably last us one year with all three of our dogs. So it's, it'll go a long way. All right, the last thing I want to talk about is our breath spray. This is also, you can find that this smells great in the mouth. But I love Pets Life Gel. And if I use Pets Life Gel, I don't necessarily use the breath spray. Uh, sometimes I do breath sprays on pets that come in for grooming, and we just do a squirt, squirt, if they didn't get like the upgrade of having the teeth done, which is the Pets Life Gel application. So it's a great additive that you can do on every pet that you groom, for instance, or at home if you have bad breath on pets. Keep in mind, sometimes if there's bad breath, there's other things going on that you probably can't see, which could be a fractured tooth or something going on with organs within or maybe disease. So make sure you, if you have bad breath, you consult your veterinarian if possible, they can give you more answers to your questions. But sometimes there's just that puppy bad breath, make sure there's no worms in the tummy for sure, but also for puppy bad breath, you could actually get just like a breast spray. Uh, because puppies, let me just talk about that for a minute. Puppies' teeth are gonna fall out. So depending on their age, you don't want to, my opinion, I wouldn't do Pets Life Gel on all the puppy teeth because they're gonna all come out and be grown in with adult teeth. Keep in mind, if you get a puppy, you wanna make sure you're checking the teeth because what I have seen over the years, and that's what I love to do is check puppy teeth when they come in because you won't even realize it, but they'll actually, here's the puppy tooth, tooth that needs to fall out and here comes the adult tooth and it'll just stack in there and you'll see two teeth there and I remember there was a chihuahua that I had done a teeth cleaning on with a toothbrush and I literally had the pet parent with me holding the pet and I was like, what is all this stuff in here? I know you have it had double teeth and it was an older dog, like nine or 10 year old. I wanna say it wasn't a chihuahua, I wanna say it was a Datsun, but it's been a long time. I took my hemostats and pulled out a layer of just buildup of like years of hair and food and debris and I just pulled it all off and hung it there and let the owner see it. I might have a picture way back when and you can see the holes where the tooth were, tooth, the teeth were sitting in all that debris, just years of buildup. He goes, I never knew it was some dried thing sticking out of his mouth and that was dried hair so crusted he said i just never knew what it was he never even tried to pull it out or nothing it was just dried up hair that was there for years and i just pulled it out of all of his teeth and looked at it and i was like wow this has been there for i don't even know how long it had rotted out all the teeth in his mouth and because it stuck there it was because there was a puppy teeth row and an adult teeth row and none of the teeth had fallen out they had just doubled up into his mouth on the top so keep an eye on those puppy teeth they should fall out okay in my opinion, at six months old on a puppy, if they haven't fallen out, you need to go have them removed out or, or get some hard treats, hard chews to help that dog start working those teeth out himself. If it still doesn't come out in about one year, you should see a veterinarian for sure if you haven't already decided to go to a vet to begin with. All right, thanks for watching Dee Dee Croy. Pick up your Pets Life Gel, your Esprit Gel, your toothbrush, your breath spray, all that at myfavoritegroomer.com. We really appreciate you watching and please share and like the video.